Avengers! Assemble. to the channel it's the preventers you guys and welcome back to another Marvel future fight video and just like we told you guys with the star lord video we got yet again and our final one i'd like to add video for what we did with the ctp unequip event we unequipped um and no we didn't unequip we acquired a rage a while ago from um not secret shop but uh, i can't think of what it is um it's another event i'm totally blanking here but it's another event that's on the side here Usually, uh, and you can gamble. I, I'll remember it at the end of the video. I'll remind you guys. Um, but I got a rage from that, and we decided to unequip the authority from Gene. We decided to make Spider-Man's authority a mighty now, and then we, of course, gave the rage to Gene. So now let's see how broken she is, because I'll tell you right now, she is absolutely broken with the rage. She's still good for PvP and timeline and other world battle, and she's amazing in World Boss Legend and GBR. She absolutely kills it. Um, we're going to do only GBR and World Boss Legend in today's video, though. And Wow, I cannot speak today. Test out how well she does. And I'll tell you guys, she's going to rock all of these stages and all these fights. Um, you guys are going to be blown away. But first, we got GBR here, Tier 4 Jean. She is the highest DPS character in the game, so therefore she's the fastest character to clear Dormammu GBR there is. Um, and we're going to be competing against the second fastest here in Black Bolt, so it's definitely going to just depend on our builds and our um cards and whatnot and swords so let's see how well this goes um yeah i'll tell you guys she's busted um i've gotten a minute and 30 not a minute and 30 i think it was like two minutes and yeah two minutes and 30 second clear um of dormammu with tier 4 genes so yeah she's uh she's pretty broken um and for wall boss legend there's not many stages that we have unlocked uh so we are also gonna obliterate that completely um, there's not enough stages on high enough stages unlocked um, with just um, her uh, requirements. We got another tier four gene coming in. Here we go. Um, so yeah, we can only do stage nine of gene, stage nine of gore, and stage nine of infinity ultron. Uh, so yeah, she's gonna obliterate them, but I I still thought I'd take her through. But when I tell you guys she's busted with the rage, she's busted with the rage. It's it's insane. She can. She can obliterate everything. And like I said, in Timeline and Otherworld, the only reason why I'm not showing you that is because it's pretty much the exact same as with the Authority. Um, the only difference that the Rage makes is in GBR War Boss Legends. So that's why I'm showcasing this and not um, anything to do with PvP content. But here we go. Time to show off our Tier 4 Gene with the Rage. This is what I'm using a lot to give you guys carries um, on Twitch. So come down to Twitch streams if you guys need a GBR carry. Uh, I'll give him any time, um, but yeah, here we go. Let's check it out. So yep, already in the lead here. The other Gene is definitely not going to be competing with us, um, and this um, Black Bolt is trying his best, but I'm not sure how well it's going to go for him. See, all this damage here hits pretty much all of me right now. As you can see, the bars are melting, and I mean melting away. They're all the way down to 26 bars. So if you thought the clip of Star-Lord popping his Tier 3 was crazy, Jean is even crazier with her rotation. She does so much damage. 26 bars, no more rotation. We're going all the way down to 16 bars. That's 10 bars with her normal rotation in the first phase of the fight. And then with the tier 3, she's going to pop off and obliterate him. It's even more than 15 bars. I didn't get to show it off there because he only had a certain amount of HP left. Uh, but now let's take a look at the second phase of the fight. Here we go. Regular rotation here, doing about two, three bars. Yep, three bars. Very nice. Um, so obviously you see the Pierce um, reduction already, but the Rage is definitely helping out compared to the Authority before. The nice thing is you don't really have to have a set rotation because uh, she can literally just spam. Here with the Tier 3 rotation, we went 35 bars down to 30. So yeah, five bar rotation there with the regular rotation. Like I said, very nice stuff. She gets it done super fast. 
it's not going to take us very long. Here we go. No tier 3 rotation in here, and then we should get down uh, to business. No, I'm kidding. Uh, we should get down uh, to his attack where he has to stop us for a little bit. I-frames doesn't let us uh, do anything right after this quick rotation. There we go. Nice. And we're going to stay right up front here so we can immediately get out um, and pop our tier 3 rotation as soon as possible. And the other good thing is she has a revive. So not only is she the most busted character for GBR, but if she ever dies, you'll be just fine because she's got a revive. Just don't get her killed twice. And if you're getting her killed twice, then what are you doing, man? <laughs> you, you can't be having that. You got to keep her alive. But yep, this is just broken. We're past the two minute mark now yeah we're two minutes and 30 seconds in so I am doing this a little bit slower than I did the other time but I did have teammates that were doing a lot more damage uh, the other time in um, two of my good friends so here we go regular rotation here and then we'll have the tier 3 rotation to finish out the fight hopefully before the three minute mark can we squeeze it in before the three minute mark here we go 14 seconds can we get this done we're going crazy popping it and she gets it done. Boom. Boom. I said a little preemptively, but boom. She gets it done in 2 minutes and 56 seconds clear of Dormammu GBR. Yep, it's it's insane, guys. She is so broken with a rage. It's not even fair to other characters. It's not. It, you can definitely tell she came out. She, she came out ahead of her time. Let's just say that. So we're starting out with Stage 9 Infinity Ultron here. The video is not going to last that much longer, guys. I'll tell you right now, she's about to obliterate these stages. Um, uh, I'm sorry that I don't have higher stages in law to showcase her in. All the higher stages I have is either combat, which she's not, superhero, which she's not, or male, which she's not. So, yeah. So, yeah, red rotation. Casually down the last eight bars already. And as soon as he lets us attack, we're going straight for the... Ooh, I got stopped there. Okay. Tier 3 rotation, and he's dead. 18 second clear of stage 9. Yep, it's that broken. Uh, that broken, yep. <laughs> I don't even know what else to tell you guys, to be honest. Um, I warned you guys, uh, she's broken. Stage 9 of gore. Here we go, no sweat for Jean. I honestly can't wait till I make her sweat a little bit. Even though I've seen videos of people like Beast Mode Gaming who are going up to stage like 90 and she's still barely breaking a sweat. So, yeah. We're going to rotation here. Down the last 15 bars here of the fight. Yeah, it's almost, honestly, after using her for so long, it's so nice knowing that I can just clear anything anytime I want as fast as I want. Um, but after doing it for the dailies, it does get a little boring. It's like, oh, okay, wow, she destroyed him. <laughs> like, I, I just can't wait to push into higher content. I'm grateful. I, I know there's some of you guys out there that are struggling with this content. Um, and I feel for you guys, like I said, that's why I do the Dormammu GBR carries, because I want to help you guys um, get better um, and get more Tier 4s and be able to clear these things. Um, but you got to understand, from a perspective like me, um, I can't wait to push into higher content, higher stages, where I get to really test out her ability, because after day after day of clearing this every day and seeing her obliterate it, it's fun, but after a while, it's like, okay, I need a challenge, you know? Um, but yeah, 55 second clear stage 9. Of gore. Very nice, very nice, very nice. And our final test, we got Jean versus Jean, or Dark Phoenix versus Dark Phoenix, whatever you want to call her. Again, on stage nine, we got all stage nine video, baby, for you guys. <laughs> Here we go. Let's finish this up. Wrap up the video. Let's see how well, or not how well, how fast she can get this done. Um, this is the best team for her in GBR and World Boss Legend, by the way. Wow, she decided, yeah, she's scared of herself. She's like, yeah, I'm going to run away. I'm not trying to get hit by myself. She knows how much damage she's about to be doing. She's like, nah, let me get away from that. Two the rotation, boom, get out of here. 30 bars. Next phase of the fight, please. 20 seconds, next phase. And we tanked the other gene, uh, little, like the little force genes. I don't know what you want to call them. Um, the little ghost things that try and kill you. We tanked that as well, so yeah, that was nice. Alright, she had a little bit of targeting issues there with the regular rotation, but it does not matter because it just gets you so quick to the tier 3 rotation, which just makes up for all that. And I can let her die here because she has a revive and she still didn't even die. But I did force her into the game mode because I, I did so much damage and attacked her so much. That was actually kind of funny. Um, so that's going to delay us a little bit. Uh, I probably shouldn't have been so greedy, 
Um, but it's all right. It's just to get the clear um, pretty easily here. But yeah, so like two rotations and boom. One rotation, actually, and then um, as soon as you get into that next rotation, it's a tier three rotation. So that's another thing that's really nice about her kit here. Um, it makes it so easy to use, so easy to play. Um, it's not complicated at all. So, yeah. Very nice stuff here from Jean. We're going to squeeze in some damage before. I probably honestly could have just killed her. Yep. Pop the tier three. A little too late. Could have definitely just wiped her off the face of the planet. Um, but I was expecting this uh, fight right here. So yeah, I screwed up. We probably would have got that done at 340. Um, so a minute and 20 seconds, but I did screw that up. Uh, I should just pop the tier three. She would have killed her. Um, but I was waiting for that little attack right there. Um, but either way, we wrap up the fight here um, within two minutes. So yeah, a minute and 40 seconds. There you go. Gene with the rage is insane like i told you guys absolutely crushing every single pve and pvp content so if you don't have gene go get her go get her new uniform slap a rage on her makes her insane highest dps character in the game anyways guys that'll do it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel guys and we'll see you all later for the patch notes video stay tuned